Here is a story about a woman who accidentally went to a scary barber and had her hair cut off. Once upon a time, in a small town nestled in the countryside, there lived a woman named Emily. Emily was known for her beautiful, long locks of hair that cascaded down her back. She took great pride in her appearance and would often spend hours styling her hair to perfection. One day, Emily was running late for work. She had forgotten to make an appointment at her regular hair salon, so she decided to go to the first one she saw. The barber shop was small and dark, and the barber himself was a scary-looking man with a long beard and a sharp knife. Emily was nervous, but she didn't have time to find another barber. With her heart pounding in her chest, Emily mustered up her courage and cautiously stepped into the barber shop. The sound of the creaking door echoed through the room, causing her to shudder. The shop's interior was dimly lit, and the scent of old leather and musty wood filled the air. The barber, a burly man with a weathered face and intense eyes, glanced up from the newspaper he was reading. A faint smile crossed his lips as he saw Emily's apprehensive expression. He gestured for her to take a seat in the worn-out barber's chair, his eyes never leaving her. She sat down in the chair and told the barber what she wanted. The barber nodded. As Emily settled into the chair, she nervously fidgeted with a strand of her long hair, contemplating whether she should just leave and find another salon. But with time ticking away and her obligations at work pressing on her mind, she decided to stay and put her trust in the barber's hands, no matter how intimidating he appeared. The barber approached Emily with deliberate steps, his every movement accentuated by the eerie silence of the room. He didn't say a word, but the glint in his eyes seemed to suggest an unspoken understanding. Emily swallowed her fears and mustered a weak smile, hoping to ease the tension. Emily felt a chill run down her spine as the barber put the faded black cloak over her shoulders and tied it tightly around her neck. She knew that something was wrong, but she didn't know what. Sensing Emily's unease, the barber paused for a moment, his gaze fixed on her reflection in the mirror. Emily's heart raced, and her mind raced with thoughts of escape. She wondered if she had made a terrible mistake by staying in this eerie barber shop. As the barber's hand reached for the scissors and approached Emily's long, cherished locks, a surge of nervousness coursed through her veins. Her heart raced, and she felt a knot form in the pit of her stomach. The familiarity of her long hair had provided comfort and security, and now it was about to be altered by this unknown barber. Emily tried to steady her breathing as the first snip of the scissors echoed through the room. She watched intently in the mirror, her eyes widening with each cut. As her hair fell to the floor, her sense of unease grew, and she wondered if she had made a mistake by entrusting her precious hair to this unfamiliar barber. The room seemed to close in around her, and the silence was punctuated only by the sound of the scissors gliding through her hair. Emily's mind raced with doubts and uncertainties. What would she look like without her long locks? Would she regret this impulsive decision? Fear and anticipation swirled within her, threatening to overwhelm her senses. As the barber continued his work, a mixture of concentration and determination etched onto his face. Gradually, as more strands of hair fell to the ground, Emily noticed a transformation taking place not just in her appearance, but also within herself. As the final strands of her hair were cut, the barber stepped back, admiring his work. As the barber's hand reached for the scissors and approached Emily's long, cherished locks, a surge of nervousness coursed through her veins. Her heart raced, and she felt a knot form in the pit of her stomach. The familiarity of her long hair had provided comfort and security, and now it was about to be altered by this unknown barber. 
Emily tried to steady her breathing as the first snip of the scissors echoed through the room. She watched intently in the mirror, her eyes widening with each cut. As her hair fell to the floor, her sense of unease grew, and she wondered if she had made a mistake by entrusting her precious hair to this unfamiliar barber. The room seemed to close in around her, and the silence was punctuated only by the sound of the scissors gliding through her hair. Emily's mind raced with doubts and uncertainties. What would she look like without her long locks? Would she regret this impulsive decision? Fear and anticipation swirled within her, threatening to overwhelm her senses. As the barber continued his work, a mixture of concentration and determination etched onto his face. Gradually, as more strands of hair fell to the ground, Emily noticed a transformation taking place not just in her appearance, but also within herself. As the final strands of her hair were cut, the barber stepped back, admiring his work. As the barber set aside the scissors and reached for the hair clippers, Emily's apprehension deepened. The sound of the clippers buzzing to life filled the air, intensifying the weight of her emotions. She watched, wide-eyed and trembling, as the barber positioned the clippers at the side of her head. With each pass of the clippers, the familiar sound of hair being cut was replaced by the hum of the clippers making contact with her scalp. Emily's heart sank and tears welled up in her eyes. The sensation of her hair being shaved down to zero on the sides and back was overwhelming, and she couldn't help but let her emotions spill over. As the barber continued his work, he noticed Emily's tears streaming down her face. He paused momentarily. As the barber exchanged the clippers for a number four guard, Emily's apprehension heightened once again. The sound of the clippers filled the air, accompanied by the nervous beating of her heart. She watched as the barber carefully ran the clippers through her hair, gradually transforming her once shaved sides and back into a flat top. With each pass of the clippers, Emily's hair shortened, leaving behind a distinct shape on the crown of her head. As the flat top began to take form, Emily's reflection in the mirror revealed a image, a hairstyle she had never imagined for herself. As the barber's hand reached for the scissors and approached Emily's long, cherished locks, a surge of nervousness coursed through her veins. Her heart raced, and she felt a knot form in the pit of her stomach. The familiarity of her long hair had provided comfort and security, and now it was about to be altered by this unknown barber. Emily tried to steady her breathing as the first snip of the scissors echoed through the room. She watched intently in the mirror, her eyes widening with each cut. As her hair fell to the floor, her sense of unease grew, and she wondered if she had made a mistake by entrusting her precious hair to this unfamiliar barber. The room seemed to close in around her, and the silence was punctuated only by the sound of the scissors gliding through her hair. Emily's mind raced with doubts and uncertainties. What would she look like without her long locks? Would she regret this impulsive decision? Fear and anticipation swirled within her, threatening to overwhelm her senses. As the barber continued his work, a mixture of concentration and determination etched onto his face. Gradually, as more strands of hair fell to the ground, Emily noticed a transformation taking place not just in her appearance, but also within herself. As the final strands of her hair were cut, the barber stepped back, admiring his work. As the barber set aside the scissors and reached for the hair clippers, Emily's apprehension deepened. The sound of the clippers buzzing to life filled the air, intensifying the weight of her emotions. She watched, wide-eyed and trembling, as the barber positioned the clippers at the side of her head. With each pass of the clippers, the familiar sound of hair being cut was replaced by the hum of the clippers making contact with her scalp. 
Emily's heart sank and tears welled up in her eyes. The sensation of her hair being shaved down to zero on the sides and back was overwhelming, and she couldn't help but let her emotions spill over. As the barber continued his work, he noticed Emily's tears streaming down her face. He paused momentarily. As the barber exchanged the clippers for a number four guard, Emily's apprehension heightened once again. The sound of the clippers filled the air, accompanied by the nervous beating of her heart. She watched as the barber carefully ran the clippers through her hair, gradually transforming her once shaved sides and back into a flat top. With each pass of the clippers, Emily's hair shortened, leaving behind a distinct shape on the crown of her head. As the flat top began to take form, Emily's reflection in the mirror revealed a image, a hairstyle she had never imagined for herself. As the barber continued to shave Emily's hair, gradually transforming it into a military-style flat top, Emily's emotions overwhelmed her once again. Tears streamed down her face, mingling with the buzz of the clippers. The sight of her hair being shaped into such a distinct and unfamiliar style brought a mix of sadness, confusion, and vulnerability. With each pass of the clippers, her tears seemed to flow more freely. She mourned the loss of her long locks, and the drastic change in her appearance intensified her emotional response. The barber worked diligently, focusing on achieving precision and symmetry unaware of the depth of Emily's distress. As the military flat top took shape, Emily glanced at her reflection in the mirror. Her tear-stained face and the newly sculpted hair made her feel unrecognizable, like a stranger looking back at her. The realization of the transformation settled in, and she grappled with conflicting emotions.